Hi, love. It's me. It's uh, Monday morning. Yes, my brother. I'm calling you on Skype. Yeah, 10 o'clock on Tuesday. So when you I read have an excellent you get news details, about But I am on the last chapter. Uh, I finished Brazil chapter 7 last night. Brazil and Miami. Call me if you can on my mobile, love. It, it okay, It looks child. like, you know, everything is going our way. So just give me a call. Yes, baby. Whenever I should be up well, late tonight. On Wednesday evening. And, I'm concerned um, I haven't heard from you. I hope you're well. Bye now. You know what's going on, okay? Care for you. Talk to you later. Bye. Longing for different answers each time I approach it. Is there such a thing? I don't answer it. It's for the viewer to answer it. And I play with different layers of oil and paint. Passion and through the selection of colors. Scratching. Texture, so the question appears and disappears through different layers and energy and uh, just unleashing and, and, it, and it, it's like just moving my arm through the canvas and it's right there. And when it's there, it creates a structure uh, that I have to deal with. I just want to deal with whatever reality appears first. It's like dealing with life. Uh, we have taken it as it comes, and we had to figure it out. Sometimes we want to create beauty and harmony out of it, and sometimes we don't. The experience is, is in between those boundaries, and longing for different answers each time I approach it. Some might say it's, it's a hidden message. Uh, well, it's, it's, it's all out there. It's all written. It just demands that the viewer uh, slows down, focus, and uh, begins to unveil the, uh, the answer to whatever his reality or her reality is. It was inspired by a friend of mine who uh, couldn't believe that each so moment we might, might need a different thing to, uh, and energy to feed the dream is right there. Yeah. We can and, reach and to make the experience deeper and richer. Hey, JR Heffelfinger. <clears throat> I'm just wishing you all. Um, what time is your thinking about that? Because I hope I can go, but I don't know if I can. So this painting is called a room with a view, and those are the letters I use. Mr. Heffelfinger, this is Alessandro calling with Vladimir. We are on a horrible, horrible place. You know, it's uh, filled with sand. Once again, it's painted over and over and over and over. And um, it took me a long time to work on this until I got the texture I wanted. Uh, it is inspired by a room with a view in the wonderful, cozy, lovely home of my friend right. Fred Hanson in Brazil. Uh, well. And I tried to capture uh, different views I had of the sky, the Rio de Janeiro from okay. uh, that room. Especially one stormy night. The storm was really very powerful and the trees and were singing and was lighting and uh, the next day was a very peaceful day but we had to uh, wait until next morning to realize the, the sun is going to be shining again on Rio and that storm was uh, really impressive um, and the show was amazing.
there is not an opportunity to capture everything just at one glance with one particular angle of light. So it will change. Um, this particular painting it's, it's saying that, it's saying love becomes visible. So the whole idea is that love is there, right there, all the time, everywhere. Um, but something from us has to take place so that it really becomes visible. Um, And I wouldn't like to say more than that, because I will take away the experience of discovering it. I'm just walking back from Tijuana, taking a piss in the parking lot. And it's very funny that you called me when you did. This is called Sink for Me, El Dia Que Me Quieras. Kind of a conversation with... In the song, there are references to different Mozart. colors. About you. I used the text of uh, about you. a very famous dark, tango, Dark of Your Eyes, and things like that. By so Carlos I decided Alvel to uh, work Alfredo only with Vera from 1935. Nice painting. And, um, and, and, and explore where it went. But I still love it. What are you going to do? We would have kids if we could. Um, I don't want any. You can't have any. So we're not going to have it. I love you, man. You're going to fucking Morocco, you asshole. Uh, launder some money for me while you're there. Don't get arrested. Don't do anything too stupid. And call me when you get back. I love you very much. Happy Thanksgiving. Jonathan, it's Nazneen. It is 10 to 6 on Friday. You were landing at Casablanca at 12. You said you would call me at 1 o'clock. What the fuck is going on? I wanted to see if I could catch you and um, maybe find some time for us to speak and maybe get together and talk to you about um, what those are. And End of message.